Welcome to Let's Play Forza Motorsport 2 Part 11. And for this segment, I'm in I'm got in my uh, Renault Clio that I've just kind of uh, had here, and we're gonna go to our next level five event, which is in the amateur thing, and it's the six cylinder show off. So, yeah, gonna be racing six cylinder cars, obviously. So here's our opponent list: Rossi in the VW Golf. So Rossi's gonna be in part of this, oh boy. So let's uh, see what three races we're gonna go to. Sunset Peninsula Short, cause now there's a short version of the uh, Peninsula Road Course. Course. Hey, the full Sakuba circuit. Didn't think I'd ever say that. And hey, New York returning from Forza 1, but only the short layout. The long, the, uh, the full course is absent from this game, and this is the only, uh, version of the New York circuit in this game, sadly, but enough of that. Let's go to Sunset Peninsula short. Alright, here we go. I'm being gridded third, and uh, here's our starting grid from last to first, so let's get to it. It's our first race of the uh, stream and the series. Anyways, off we go. Nice little launch there. Also, I did turn up the uh, game volume a bit in OBS, because I noticed some of the uh, later segments I recorded last, like, couple days ago, hey, Scotian, was, uh, although they show as being quite loud on OBS, it didn't, they didn't, the engine sounds didn't seem all that loud compared to my voice, so I don't fucking know, so I turned that shit about up, back up, not a lot, but a bit, so yeah. Which six cylinders, best six cylinder. Clearly my Clio. As I'm proving right now. So hooray. Hey bleak. <coughs> Hello, cough. Me out of four hours of thing. Oh, is that what you're doing, K boys? Hooray, me out of four hours. Also, hey, Sunset Peninsula. Just a skosh. Just a skosh is like my catchphrase or some shit. Also, hello Davis with a lot more straight line speed than me. Like, a lot more. But not nearly as many balls as me. This AI loves taking that first uh, kink there very slowly. Uh huh. Of course, our difficulty. I wouldn't have it any other way. I have all the difficulty maxed out, so I'm getting the maximum amount of credits, aka 50% bonus. Daryl Waltrip said just a skosh yesterday. BW, don't be stealing my lines, yo. I'll fucking... I'll cut you. Boy. Old man. I don't know what I'm saying. <laughs> Nice bank, yeah. High banked track, yo. Because, you know, part oval, part infield road course. Uh, in the long races, yes, there are pit stops, ca Cam, but that's only in the endurance races, because, yeah, they're the only races long enough to uh, have pit stops. Also, I win, yay. Yeah, DW watches me, confirmed. So, uh, that was a pretty easy first race, despite Davis having the incredible straight line speed advantage, but couldn't do anything about it, so. There we go, race one complete, getting 300 rarity bonus from a 5.0 rarity, nice. 4,800 overall, hey, put me to level 13, nice. So, uh, looks like we've unlocked some more Vauxhalls, and let's go to race two. Alright, here we go, race two at Sakuba. For how many laps? I'm not sure, I think three. Let's, uh... Yeah, three laps. Play. <laughs> like, I was looking on the stream, like, where where the fuck is the P... Where the fuck is the, uh, lap counter? I forgot where it was on the HUD. For a moment. GG me. Boy, here we go. Time for the Rossi v Rhino showdown. What ma uh, what makes the Diablo GP so hard? Um, the AI is ridiculously fast, and the cars are also ridiculously fast. And pretty much one, well, this is, uh, 
more so with Mythical Coast because it's a much, much shorter track. What, pretty much one major mistake and you're guaranteed not to win the race. It took me like, what, three or four hours to win that race, I swear to god. It's just fucking awful. And stuff. Hey, Coltrane, thanks for hosting me. Alright, yeah. You know what's funny, Zonic? I was just watching that review, like, right before I started streaming. Fucking CGR review Forza 5. Last time I played Green Turismo, it gave me a free car. Last time I played Forza, I was afraid I'd have to buy my cars back. It's great. Uh, I, I was kind of on a slight uh, classic game room binge right before like on a couple hours leading up to my stream. Because why the fuck not? Lord Carnage is cool. That was a big slide. But we're good. Oh, that was a big lockup. I hear Rossi's car just fucking screaming behind me. But he's not really doing anything about it. Yeah, Rossi of all people trying to keep it. Well, then again, he's just a crazy Italian who's fast. The real aggressive man, I believe, was uh, is Taylor <laughs> or something like that. Uh, he's only a. Yeah, kind of yes and no. RH that he's a jackass. I think he's he's kind of a uh, exaggerated a little bit within the Forza community just because he's so infamous. Maybe not so in this game. May maybe when I get to Forza three. Maybe <clears throat> we'll see. But yeah. Right now, he's having a hell of a time holding off Davis for se uh, second. Yeah, second. Second is the position he's racing for. Yes, yes. Oh, they're neck and neck. Davis has got the advantage. I'm fucking sliding. Holy shit. Let me just uh, spaghetti the final turn. Oh, Rossi got the advantage on the outside of the turn. Damn. Damn straight, I'm doing every event in Forza 3. I mean, it's. I mean, I am a completionist after all when it comes to my LP, so if you have to ask, hey, will I do X in game, 99% of the time the answer is yes. Anyways, hey, we got more things, and we got level 1 for this car. Sweet, so. Spring and damper, damper discount for Peugeots, Renaults, and Seats. Hooray. Alright, here we go. Final race at New York. This one... Might have a little issues holding off Davis since it's New York, very high speed circuit, so. But we shall see. <clears throat> Harry, you're talking to me about Forza 4 as if I've never played the game before. I don't think you understand. <laughs> Not only have I played through all of Forza 4, I used to be a competitive hot lapper in that game. Slim semi competitive. Plus, I even did a league race, like the only league racing I ever did was in Forza 4. Bro. I know the game. <laughs> Just saying. Anyways, we've got the early advantage. Hey, Confer. Conference. Con. Con. Yeah, no chicanes on this route. That was added in Forza 3. So yeah, this is the only uh, version of New York, like I said earlier, in this game. They did away with the uh, long version of the whoops. That was great. That was the uh... yeah. They did away with the long version of the uh, course. So hooray! I guess. Oh, hello, everybody's taking a very different line. Yeah, I broke the 
headlight cover. Oh no. Fucking raw. Oh, okay. That's still a thing, apparently. They, if, depending on what lane they are, they're just like, ah, oh, brakes, oh god. They just panic. This is a Formula E track. I know, right? FedEx Kinkos. Ooh. Let's just look at all the fucking uh, advertising and product placement. Clipping. What was clipping? I wasn't even paying attention. What was clip? Oh shit, here comes Davis. Oh, I outbroke Davis. Almost outbroke myself. Those melting brakes. Hey, Dustin. Okay. Got a big advantage over Davis. Don't have to worry about him. Then again, there's one more lap, so we're good. I'm like, wait a minute. This isn't a final lap. What am I saying? Here comes Davis, especially now that I touched the wall. Is he going to slam on the brakes? Yep, he slammed on the brakes. Note, if they go way to the left there, on that very, very slight right-hand bend approaching turn one, they will slam on the brakes. All right. Good to know. <coughs> okay, I'm expecting Davis to get relatively close here. It's within 50 meters. And he's not going to get anywhere close to me. Alright. I do not have the Platinum Hits disc with all the DLC. I have most most of the DLC on like my actual like my actual Xbox Live account, but that shit's like account locked because it's you know I don't know AMGS, but yeah. The only DLC that matters is the Ferrari F50 GT because oh my fucking god that car is so OP. It, it's so incredibly OP in this game. Also, I win, clean sweep, first try. Cleo too strong. Too fast, too strong. I don't know. And there we go, everyone's crossed the line. Hey, everyone made it just under four minutes for the race. A little bit of body damage from my errors, but not too bad. So, yay! I think in Forza 3 and 4, the DLC was like not account locked. I'm pretty sure. Anyways, we want a car, and 4,500 credits, and also a gold trophy. What the car is? It's this, the fucking Tommy Kyra R34. Nice prize. Holy shit. Nice uh, epic B-class car. For whenever I have to do epic B-class races, I can have that as an option. So there's the six-cylinder shoot-off, shoot show-off, done. And that's the only level five event in the... Uh, amateur race section so we're gonna move on to uh yeah the next series and a different race type and stuff stay tuned for more forza 2